can see on the timer behind Donna Jean Wild, this grandmother of 12 recently planked for three hours and then just kept going. How long was it? Four hours, 30 minutes, and 11 seconds. <laughs> I think that's more than my entire life combined. With that time and that 58 years old, Donna Jean is now the Guinness World Record holder for any woman attempting a plank. I had someone ask me, like, how do you feel about always being called grandma? But I love that. I love that title because I love my grandkids. Actually, all 12 of her grandchildren were present at a place very special for the family. McGrath Elementary Junior and High School in their hometown of Alberta, Canada is where many of the grandkids go, where all five of Donna Jean's children went, and where she and her husband of 40 years, Randy, were high school sweethearts. Oh, and she just retired a few years ago from teaching and being vice principal there. It was fun to do it there. Not to mention, her family played a key role in helping Donna Jean discover her abdominal superpower. Good morning, everyone. Remember that planking craze from a decade ago? Well, right around that time, Donna Jean had actually just broken her wrist. And when she couldn't run or lift weights while she wore a cast for months, it was her children who introduced her to the trendy exercise of clenching your stomach. I was so happy because I thought, hey, I can do something with a cast. But how did she get from minutes to hours? Well, once she got her cast off. Every time I needed to do schoolwork or emails or anything, I'd just get down and plank. You were planking and doing schoolwork? Yep. Ten years and many graded papers later, Donna Jean applied to Guinness World Records, and a few weeks ago, an official came to record her attempt in front of friends, family, and many of her former students. I'm so glad it, that I did try, that we did all that work. So now I'm not going to look back and say, I wish I, I wish I would have tried. Now, the rules were pretty strict, okay? Donna Jean could not wear shoes, and her hands and feet couldn't leave the ground all four and a half hours. But Randy, husband of the year, was allowed to bring her water, which she could sip through a straw while she was there for all four and a half of those hours. In New York, for ABC News, I'm Danny New.